it's Rob from RobCarbon.com here, here to show you how to use Hootsuite to schedule your tweets. Now, I just want to show you what I'm talking about first of all. Usually, I tweet between the hours of half past 12 p.m. after midday until 6 p.m. UK time, GMT or BST, something like that. It's more or less. So, as you can see, that's only about a quarter of the day. And what I'd like to do, of course, is tweet for the whole 24 hours of the day, not just those six hours which are the busiest hours of the day as they are the hours that are most busy in North America. Anyway, I've got Twitter followers from all over the world and I'm sure they're on Twitter every minute of the day so I would like to repeat the tweets all the time. So ideally, this is an example of what I'd like to do. At 3 o'clock in the morning, when I'm in my bed, I'd like to schedule a tweet with a useful article that my followers would enjoy at three o'clock and then ten minutes later at ten minutes past three another one ten minutes later at twenty minutes past three you guessed it another one and then interspersed with all this I'd like to put a tweet of one of my articles in and generally I'd like to do this 24 hours a day tweeting out good quality stuff interspersed every three or four tweets with one of my links and I'll show you how to do that in Hootsuite. So if you go to Hootsuite, that's H-O-O-T-S-U-I-T-E dot com and create an account, but I'm going to log in. So when you log into the Hootsuite dashboard, you get these streams that you can set up. And I've got them set up for my Twitter feeds, but I'll show you these later. I just want to show you how you set them up. If you go to Rob Coven, you can then click on Add to Social Network and you can add Twitter, LinkedIn, Facebook, other Facebook pages, and other Twitter accounts you have. But if I go back to streams, and I want to show you how to schedule a tweet. This is where you compose a message and schedule the message. But as we're just doing Twitter, I want to click on that one, which is Facebook, and click on that one, which is LinkedIn. So I'd leave just my Twitter account because I just want to do Twitter at the moment. Then, what I want to do is get a good article, first of all, from my sent tweets. And here's one here, which is the alternatives for Google Reader, which is quite useful because Google is stopping Google Reader. And here's a big list of alternatives that people can use. So that's quite a good article. It's not by me. So I'll copy that, paste it in here, and click on scheduling and let's go for three o'clock in the morning. There it is, we've got the article name followed by the link and we'll schedule that. And let's do another one. Tactics, tools, tips to create a strong social media content strategy. Let's have a look at that one. And this is another good evergreen article. This is actually a particularly good article on social media strategy great evergreen content that can go out four or five times it doesn't matter it's very unlikely that someone will see that you've tweeted out something twice in 48 hours or something like that nothing wrong with that so we can simply copy that one paste it in again we want to click off those two so we get just Twitter and Wednesday three o'clock in the morning at 3.10 a.m. Schedule that and that will go out. Message scheduled. Now I just want to try and remove these every time. I'm going to take off that pin and take it off there and then hopefully I'll only get the Twitter icon appearing every time. So let's do another one. How not to use Google Plus have a look at the article and this looks like good evergreen content again again it's about social media so we've had three about social media and I would ideally like to mix that up a bit and have more about design blogging tech other things that I know my followers are going to be interested in but let's do that one anyway so there it is schedule Wednesday 3 20 a.m schedule there it goes out just to the Twitter account remember and so what did I say every third or fourth one should be one of mine and I've got a list of them here so let's get that starting a chart WordPress child theme with Genesis 
and let's schedule that for Wednesday 3.30 a.m. Schedule. Okay, so ideally we want to go quite far down this list to tweets that I've done yesterday and the day before and of course we want to ignore these ones, these are just personal tweets that are at somebody. We also want to ignore ones that are just comments. For example there I've written out Brazil because they just won the Confederations Cup. Uh, it has no link, it's not very useful so we wouldn't want to copy and send that one out again. Another way of doing this of course is to go to my profile at twitter.com forward slash Rob Cubbon and what you can do is scroll down there and you might be able to see the links and the tweets more easily and so exactly the same again I usually like to delete the name of the blog from the title of the blog post but in this case I left it on because it was copy blogger this will be a very high quality article about when to email your emailing list quite a good tweet that one so same again we just copy it here and make sure you've got all the title and all the link go back to Hootsuite paste it in make sure we've just got the Twitter icon there and we'll schedule that for 3 o'clock on Wednesday at 3.40pm OK, I hope you enjoyed that this is Hootsuite which is a free service that can easily be used to schedule your tweets and Facebook and LinkedIn updates through the day. This has been Rob from robcobham.com. Goodbye.